and we are back so let's oh okay let's leave let's see where the oh yeah are we here but why he wants to see me that's the woman we saw with Rachel's dad Weird. Who oh, she is? Yo, Frank. It's Chloe. I don't know the secret password, man. Is the password drugs? Price, get your ass in here. Hmm. What's happening? Dude, it smells like piss in here. Shut up. You have a rough night or something? <laughs> Every night's a rough night. I've got a notebook in the back somewhere. Go get it for me, would you? Who is that one? Ah! What? Ah! God. Jeez, man. Get my notebook, Price. Then we'll talk. Okay. Fetching things for Frank. How low can I go? Sorry, Frank. I didn't know it was your RV when I wrote that. Oh, crap. Fight the power. A betting slip? $1,200? Way out of my league. So Frank's a fellow survivor of Black Hell. Who knew? Ugh, gross. <laughs> I'll use. Wait, Frank got a puppy? For real? Ah, oh, man. Rachel the therapist would have a field day with this. You will come, okay. Shit. The mill burned down. Jeez, that's an expensive dog. Hmm. Got it. Okay. Yeah, shopping list. It was the. Drugs. Uh, <laughs> uh, what we have? No, we don't need. Frank must be spending hundreds of dollars on this dog. Ah, uh, dog food. Okay. Don't mind if I do. Don't even fucking think about it. Damn. <laughs> Here, bro, slow. Fine. What? Whoa! Hey there. It's okay, little guy. Aw, oh, shit! Pompadou, get up here! Pompadour. You little killer. Mm. Wonder what Frank eats when he gets the munchies. Uh, open. I can open it. What? This beans? That's an insane amount of beans. <laughs> oh, okay. 
Let's see. Hello? Guess Frank finally gave up on the stake. A throne fit for... Frank. <laughs> Frank. Yeah. Where is the book? Frank and his BFF. That's... Like, wow. That pillow is... Definitely dead. A swingy, flippy instrument of death. Oh, maybe I should look. Maybe it's is there. This one, I think it is. Glad I paid that off. Chloe 175. Time to find out what Frank wants to discuss. Okay. Is this it? Have a seat. Pompadour, huh? That's one badass name for a dog. It's French. Hmm. Does it mean, like, tough guy or something? Do I look like I speak fucking French? <sighs> okay, so who was that woman? What woman? The one I saw coming out of your RV? Oh yeah, I meant to introduce you. Her name is Mind Your Own Fucking Business. Okay, I want to... Rachel would want to know more. I bet I can convince Frank it's harmless to tell me. Dude, okay. I'm just curious. What's the big deal? Idiot. I make money by being discreet. Uh... No shit, Frank. You think I don't know about hiding things from other people? I'm a teenager. Come on, Price. I gotta protect my clients. Happy customers are the foundation of a good business. Okay. Hey, so... Uh, I had this dream the other night about a cloud that swallowed Arcadia Bay. You too? See? We're a lot alike, Frank. We've got shit in common. Sure, I guess. So why are you so hung up on this chick? Uh... I'm... I'm not. Okay. Just hanging with a friend here. A friend I don't know much about. Tell me, Frank. Seeing any girls lately? <laughs> I don't know. Frank. Talk. And I'll get my mom to make you something special. Like what? Uh... How about that firehouse chili of hers? You... You got it. The woman you saw. Her name's Sarah. Showed up a few weeks ago. Causing all kinds of trouble for all sorts of people. Like who? It's a little out of your league, okay? But what kind of trouble, exactly? Forget about it, Chloe. Shouldn't have opened my mouth. Thanks for telling me. Whatever. You hear the mill burn down? Yeah. I uh, heard some stuff about it. Crazy. <laughs> My friend Damon runs the place. He lost a lot of money last night. Uh. How about you? Did you lose anything in the fire? No, but I'll probably get pulled into whatever shit Damon's dealing with right now. Lately, he's been doing some stuff that I don't like, but I don't seem to have much leverage with him like I once had. Anyway, you and I have shit to discuss. Okay. I've got a little job for you. Open my notebook, last page. Should be some entries for a kid named Drew. You know him? Drew North? Y yeah, he's... Oh, holy shit. That's a lot of money. Drew runs Oxy for Damon. Apparently football players eat it like candy. That's smart, I guess. It pays well? Go Bigfoots. Problem <laughs> is, Drew owes a grant, and he's not answering my calls. You know what's going on with them? 
Uh, Moby? Don't talk. No, I never talked to him. Or his type. No one's just a type, Price. Anyway, here's the job. I'm taking you to Blackwell. Go to Drew's room, find the money, and I'll meet you to pick it up. Can you handle that? Yeah, of course, but what's in it for me? I'll give you a 10% cut of the money. Okay. Yeah, sure. I'll do it. What's the matter? It might be a little tough. I, I'm not supposed to be at Blackwell. I got expelled this morning. Congratulations. Still easier for you to go on campus than for me. Yeah, probably. If you can't even do this price... A hundred dollars closer to leaving Arcadia Bay. With a bit of cash and the truck fixed, Rachel and I could really do it. We could leave for good. Hmm. I'll do it. Good deal. <laughs> I wonder owns thousand maybe he has more money even or maybe I have a choice I give a little Didn't bit think I'd be back this soon keep it more oh i tell i didn't find any money well here goes nothing okay let's see better hurry up and get into the dorms yeah Okay. Uh, what these? No, no, not this one. No. What is it? Two. Closet door. Maybe in door. Pats a pain. Pat. Pats. Message board. Okay. Let's see. Wait. I think I can. <laughs> Welcome to hell. Okay. Closet or maybe next one. Max would have jumped on that photographer position. Okay. Blackwell Academy. Conserving water since uh. never. Evan's subject for the day. Better you than me, bird. What are you doing? Shh. Ah, oh, the bird. Oh, okay. What are you doing here? What? Aren't you supposed to be at home thinking over your endless list of questionable decisions? Dude, why do you care about my questionable decisions? It offends me when intelligence is wasted. <laughs> Did Evan just call me intelligent? Hmm. Damn straight. Wow. Evan looks really ridiculous. Uh, mock him. 
Hey, uh, Evan? As intelligent as you look right now, y you can still see that bird from where I'm standing. I appreciate your concern, but I want to get this shot exactly right. And I've learned something about myself recently. I've learned that if I'm passionate about something, it's probably the right thing to care about. Forest fires, for example. You should have signed my petition. <laughs> it's not like anyone else did. Did you really expect people to care? People are so eager to pass on responsibility to anyone else so that they can live comfortable, unworried, and ultimately meaningless lives. You see what happened? Uh... Evan, you're pretty stuck up. Did you know that? It's fine. The first sign of greatness is people disliking you. A anyway, you're not supposed to be here. You should leave. Hmm. Okay. Let's see. Samuel, of course. Such a nice white door. Though, it feels like it's missing something. Does nice work, Samuel. Hmm. Huh. <laughs> That's some intellectual shit, Samuel. Hey, Samuel. Keeping busy? Always, Chloe Price. I didn't think you'd be returning to these hallowed halls so soon. <laughs> Neither did I. I have the feeling it wasn't uh, the books or bricks of Blackwell that led you back. <laughs> what? You're here for someone. A special someone, yes? Hmm. What do you think of uh, Rachel Amber? Rachel Amber is a dragon made of diamonds. That's, uh, deep. <laughs> do you just make this shit up on the fly, or do you, like, write it down beforehand? Are you angry all the time because you like the way it feels? Or is it merely a desperate defense against experiencing true intimacy with others? Uh... I'm, uh... <laughs> Uh, looking for Drew North. Most look at Drew North and see only the athlete, but he is more than that. He is? A great heart he has, with much love and no room for fear. <sighs> I've always thought he was kind of a bully. He may be that, too. No one is just one thing. Okay. So, uh, what about Elliot Hampton? Have you seen him recently? I only see what Elliot wants me to see. Okay... Usually I can see both what people want me to see and what they want to keep hidden. Hmm. And, uh, what, what do I want to keep hidden? That you are lonely and afraid. Uh, what's the... Uh... It's okay. Not to be okay, Chloe Price. I've got to go, man. Uh, <laughs> it's been real. I often wonder what real is. Farewell, Chloe Price. Hmm. Damn. That was some deep. Rachel looks awesome. 
I might actually enjoy the show tonight. Just... Ugh. Yeah, let's think about something. It doesn't feel different. I don't belong here anymore. It's not my school. I, uh, I don't have a school. But nothing feels different. Everything still feels shitty. And here I am, about to break into the freaking dorm so I can steal money that Drew owes my drug dealer. This is gonna go great. Hmm. Okay. What? Hey, Steph. Whoa. Hey, Calamastia. Surprised <laughs> to see me on parole? I told you Wells was out to get you. That text was a rare courtesy, by the way. I don't normally get involved in other people's dumb decisions. Hmm. Thanks for trying, but skipping yesterday was totally worth it. Skipping with Rachel Amber does have an appeal. Well, yeah. So what are you doing here? Hmm, yeah. Uh, I figured I'd see the Tempest. For real? You? Yeah, I know. It's not really my thing. Uh, <laughs> kinda hoping it's a shit show. What the hell? I'm the stage manager. Oh, I think I knew that. My bad. You better mean it. Honestly, the show's really good. It's worth seeing. I'm sure it is. Obviously, Rachel's fantastic, but everyone else is pretty impressive, too. You get to see a totally different side of everyone, especially the guys. Hmm. Okay. I'm intrigued. Go on. Like, Hayden's so annoying, but when he puts on that crown, he's actually very princely. And Nathan is Caliban? There's so much depth there. Right. Depth. Yeah, well, good luck with all of that. <laughs> Maybe I'll see you later. Oh, hey. I wanted to ask you something. Shoot. I've been planning to make a move on Rachel, but not if you two were together. What? Make a move? So, are you? Uh, I mean, that's Rachel's business, or maybe yours and Rachel's business, but if you feel comfortable telling me... Uh... Huh... I... No, I want to make it messy a little bit. No, let's say she's single. I, because it's true, she is. But yeah, let's do it. She's single. You sure? That's what I said. I'll see you later, Steph. Have fun storming the castle. Okay. I'll see you at the Tempest, right? No. Okay, Why, let's... yes. Chloe, of course you may look through that. Okay, thank you. <laughs> Steph's really good at creating fantasy worlds. I can see why Mikey prefers them to his reality. Uh, yes, this is the play. Yeah, the play. Most the thing. Okay. So let's go and go and st steal something. 
but let's finish here before that. Bye bye.